Good day and welcome. I'm McKnight from Gamer and we are playing Greedfall. So, without any further ado, let's get to it. Let's just refresh our missions or quests. Okay, I need to locate and mark the merchandise crates, explore, set up. Okay, this looks like fun. Um, and help that merchant do that. Okay, cool. And the main quest can wait for now. So, okay, and I saw loot somewhere. Okay, so now we're going to locate and mark the merchandise crates. A reserve for notes. Okay. Guess I may need to take a different route inside. Okay. There's a way, okay. Let's hop over the wall yet. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Let me just save. Uh, No, these aren't the right crates. No, these aren't the right crates. No, these aren't the right crates. Need a bit of practice. No, I wanted to say I'm not Assassin's Creed yet. Wow, there's lots of loot everywhere. Wow, I don't. I'm not complaining. Hopefully I get to use it. Can I check for loot here? Yeah. Can I loot here? Yeah. Okay, let's enter there. Apparently. They're not strict. Here are the crates we've been looking for. It appears that one of them has been broken. It's full of weapons. That doesn't seem right. It is our clients that supply us weapons on Tier 3D. You didn't know what was in the crates? No. I don't concern myself with the commander's business. I should take a look into this. I have some friends here that must know what this is all about. Let me know what you discover. Now, let's mark these crates and get going. Okay, so now inform the coin guard. Okay, gonna check for loot. Well, I mean, yeah. Okay. 
No, I can't jump. Now we need inform the coin guard barrack score master. Let's meet the bridge alive governor about medical. Inform the coin guard. Good. Okay, let's do that. <coughs> Good people, the cure and wine from the continent. Tia Pradia. Damn it, where am I now? Let me just mark my. Okay, I'm on my route. I'm on route still. Okay, where's that like guy? We'll make it for you. Yeah. Okay. Hello, Your Excellency. We found a way into the storehouse and we marked all of the crates. Perfect. I shall ask my men to follow the same path. One of the crates was damaged. I was quite surprised by what I found in it. Really? To be honest with you, the commander never told me what was in them. I received the order to deliver them as soon as Kurt accomplished his mission without any further instructions. For what it's worth, I thank you for your help, and I hope you can accept this modest token for everything you've done. If you have another moment, Your Excellency, I would like to ask you for your help. We have a serious problem that I did not hear of until recently. A problem that concerns you closely. I'm listening. I was told that some of our soldiers have been extorting large sums of money from the town merchants under the pretext of financing their protection. Are you telling me that the Guard is extorting merchants in our city? Indeed. Some merchants have been assaulted, and one of them has even been found dead. I hope you don't intend to conceal this information. If my cousin learns of this... Oh no, certainly not, Your Excellency. We intend to punish the guilty party with the greatest severity. But the merchants refuse to give us the slightest testimony. The guard frightens them, and rightly so. We won't be able to put a stop to these crimes without outside help. Count on me. I'll take care of it. Mm. No, thank you. Okay, I've gained a level. Hopefully I can choose a new skill. Let's see. Okay, I want a, a talent. Yes. Figure. Science. I would definitely want lock picking. Injection. Okay, let me just skills first. Okay, so we one 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 one. Okay, now it's attribute points. I don't have any attribute points. Talents I have. Okay, so I'm gonna allow you to craft basic weapons, armor upgrades. Oh, that's cool. And then that's simple. That allows you to make simple potions. That slightly reduces motion price, slightly improves your companion's combat abilities. Let you pass through certain difficult passages that require balance. Okay, oh, that's that jump thing I needed. I'm gonna take 
increases the map and increases the number of ingredients and objects sometimes through gathering and looting unlocks more contextual dialogue options i'm gonna max out this first because that's what the game said in the beginning cool and then okay the man with the silver coin question the merchants Let's question the merchants. It's quite a cool game this. I never thought it would be this fun. Um, okay, let's question this guy. Greetings! You look like someone who would know how to use a blade. If you're looking for the best steel, you're in the right place. Weapons, armors, ammunition, I have it all. And if you have a special request, my associates will be glad to make it for you. Um, talk about the merchant who was asking about the extortion. I'm currently investigating an extortion case involving the guard. Are you one of the merchants who has been threatened? No! Not at all. And I've never heard of this business. Someone must have lied to you. Really? Come on. If you want these guards to be arrested, you need to talk to me. I mean no offence, but you won't be able to do anything. And snitching don't end well. I want to hold on to my business. And my life. How about some new armour, Your Excellency? I was told that someone found a merchant's body. Did you know him? Of course. The town isn't that big. We all know each other here. Poor Reno. We found his body on the street by the port. He was beaten to death. One of his associates half-heartedly took over the shop. Have the culprits been found? No. Listen. Nobody wants to talk about this. We don't want any trouble. It's been months since it happened. An investigation's not gonna bring him back. You are obviously a victim of these bandits. One of your people is dead. Yet you refuse to help me. Why? It's precisely because one of our people is dead. Now, you can either buy something or let me get back to work. Because I am not going to say one more word about this case. I have something the wrong law of here. silence is at work. Nobody saw anything, nobody knows anything. Want armor that fits you like a glove? We'll make it for you. Okay, next merchant. Come closer, good... Madam, I am pleased to welcome you to the best wine and spirit shop in Tierfredi. If you're looking for something to accompany a fine meal, or for a gift for someone, you've come to the right place. Thank you, but I'm not here for that. No. I am conducting an investigation. Some merchants are being extorted by members of the guard. Uh, are you sure? It's probably just a nasty rumor. Someone must have misinformed you. Come now. I am the legate of the congregation. If guards threaten you, I could arrange protection for you. Threats? No. I assure you. Tell him about the merchant that was found dead. I was told a merchant had been found dead. Really? Oh, I didn't know. No one told me about that. What was his name? Come on, don't take me for a fool. You know very well who I'm talking about. I don't, really? I don't. So, what sort of wine would you like to pair your food with? You need something strong when eating game? You're obviously terrified. Don't you think it's better to tell me everything? Listen, I've no desire to get into trouble. Please leave me. But if you don't help me, you will never be rid of these guards. I told you, I don't know what you're talking about. Hmm, okay. Hopefully this guy will... Speak up. 
Excellency! Welcome back to my modest shop. It is an immense honor for me to be of service to such noble clientele. What might I do for you? Ask about the extortion problems the merchants have had. I am conducting an investigation. Apparently some merchants are being extorted by some members of the guard. Really? That's... that's terrible, Your Excellency. As Legate, it is my duty to ensure the safety and well-being of the citizens of our town. So please, if you have any information... I... I don't know anything. Really. I have only been here for a few months. My partner, who ran the shop before me, had a very bad encounter. And you fear the same thing happening to you? This is what happens around here. So I prefer to hold my tongue and do what is expected of me. If you denounce them, we could end this and charge these men for their crime. I can't take that risk. There are so many of them. Also, I would not be able to name them. Now, I would like to get back to my work. What we need is the money to return, do you understand? We are very... monitored. Ask for his help to stop the culprits. I have a plan to stop the culprits, but I'm going to need your help. The next time one of these guards comes to squeeze money out of you, you must ask for more time. The man will threaten you, of course, and he will certainly bring his accomplices. But when they come back in full force to make you pay for your audacity, we will be there to apprehend them. And if your plan fails, I'll end up like Renault. You don't understand. It's. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to. I'm gonna offer him money. We'll come back These later. guards really managed to terrify you. I'll be back later, hoping you've changed your mind. Thank you for your visit. See okay, you let's soon. leave him for now. Um. Let's do something else. Let's see. Okay. Um, an aspiring merchant obtain a patent. Let's go and find that for him. Must I jump the wall again? Yeah. Looks like it. Let loot. More loot. Well, that was a nice find. Um, uh, it's probably because I wear the same outfit as them. That's why they're not chasing me. that patent quickly let's see on the map where is that we go all the way here governor's palace okay been running the wrong way Copper district. You'll find all you need. Come closer, good people. The cure is going So I need to go through here, yeah, I think. 
and the acid waste day as well. Okay, go through yet. Minister. Your Excellency, it is always an honor. How may I serve you? Daddy, I'm about the island merchant. I would like to talk to you about an islander who is trying to set up shop in our city. Since he doesn't have a patent, his wares get confiscated as soon as he receives them. And you want me to provide him with the said patent? I would be delighted to show you the procedure to follow so that we may study his request. You'll understand that we cannot give an authorization without having determined the value of the goods beforehand. We must determine the tax rate according to this value, determine the best emplacement for this business. In short, these things take time. A lot of time. Try to convince him. Okay. I'm certain that my cousin will be delighted to hear that our relations with the natives are progressing in a significant way. And he will probably be very grateful to the minister who helped their first merchant set up shop in our city. Perhaps, Your Excellency. But our governor wouldn't be pleased if I didn't determine the fitting tax rates. Minister, allow me to insist. Alas, your insistence will not change a thing. I heard your request and it will be processed. It is only a matter of a few months. Would yeah. you like anything else? Really? What exactly is your role here? I am tasked with advising Governor Constantine about business matters. And I make sure that all business contracts are established properly and are favorable to us. I am responsible for setting taxes on goods based on their value, among other things. It is an exciting job that requires the utmost care. Would you like anything else? No. That'll be all. Goodbye, Your Excellency. This pencil pusher is as rigid as a halberd. Do you know how to make him change his mind? Sir de Corsillion knows all the subtleties of courtiers. He'll know how to convince him. And then there was like a question mark in the next room. That's the jail. Okay, it's like this. This is the cellar. Looks like archives or something. This guy needs to do his job. Yes, it's full fiend, yeah. Ok, 
Okay, let's check the map. Need to go through here. Okay. Kitchen. I have keys, man. Seven keys for governor's room, I think. Okay. What is this? Upper floor. Okay, there's no way to go up. Okay, I'm use the steps or the stairs. quickly De the sad day, my young student. What can I do for you? To talk about the camps. No, I, don't, I haven't done it yet. So talk about Professor. Yes. I found no traces of Professor Serafedin yet. That's most regrettable. But keep looking for him, will you? You never know. Uh, okay. Can that's... your old professor still prove himself useful? Yes, I'm asking about help. Convincing the minister. I would like to enlist your help in making the Minister of Commercial Affairs see reason. Did our finickety Minister of Paperwork bother you? He refuses to speed up the procedure to create a patent needed by a native merchant. The poor man has already had his wares confiscated several times, despite the fact that if he were given permission to set up shop in our city, it would certainly improve relations with our neighbors. I'm not surprised. This man really loves to lose himself in writing up pointless paragraphs. Let me write you a recommendation letter. He'll see my seal, and I'm certain that he'll become more compliant. Thank you for your help, sir. Don't mention it. Always delighted to help you. And to bother this annoying little man. <laughs> Can your old professor still prove himself useful? It's all for now. Looking forward to seeing you again, Sir de Corsillon. That's probably where my cousin is. Uh, I'm not gonna bother him now. Let's go to this paperwork, dude. I'm back. Minister. Your Excellency, it is always an honor. How may I serve you? I would like to have another discussion with you about the patent for the merchant whom I told you about. As I explained, these things take time. But I'm listening. Sir de Corsillon was kind enough to give me a letter addressed to you. A letter? Of recommendation, I suppose. Ah, I see. I have no other choice but to accept your request. But I hope all merchants will not make use of the same special favors. Here's the patent that will allow your protege to legally pursue his activity in the city. You should give him this copy, the other one will be kept in the archives. However, one of my representatives will visit his stall for the estimation and to determine the tax rate in accordance with the... Thanks a lot, Minister. Looking forward to seeing you again. Would you like anything else? No, thank That'll you. That'll be all. Goodbye, Your Excellency. 
Ik ga give dat poor guys patent. Ah, oh, it's day and night cycle as well. Cool. You came back. Something terrible happened. What is it? I was just bringing you the patent you needed to set up shop. The Bod Irony came back and they took my cousin away. He came to bring us animal pelts and new objects from the village. But the warriors came back. They took everything he was bringing me. And they also took him. Oh, I don't know what they will do with him. Please, bring him back to me. I don't see why they would have arrested your cousin, but I'll try to find out. Cool. I think I'm gonna call this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. And please remember to hit that like button, subscribe if you like my content, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay safe and happy gaming, and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.